told. The food is here. The food is here. Oh. This Finally. Is like Welcome to South Sudan, the world newest country, and this is my country number 18 in Africa. Anytime that I travel to a new country, I always want to show you new things that you are not used to it. So I am here to have fun, but also educate you. I also need to show you the culture of that particular country that I visit. And since I'm in South Sudan, and since you all know that your favorite village boy loves food over women, I need to show you what they eat in this beautiful country, South Sudan. But hey, I've always been telling you that collaborate, don't hate. So I've got beautiful YouTubers in South Sudan and I'm definitely gonna do this video with them and they are gonna tell me what they eat in this country. Are you sure you guys are gonna tell me what they eat in this country? We are ready. 100%. Really good food. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Welcome to South Sudan. Thank you so much. How do you say thank you in this country? Shukran. Shukran. Yes. Okay. Shukran. I'm so hungry. Do you guys know that? You should be. <laughs> and because since I came to this country, yes. I've not tasted any food because I'm waiting to eat that special. That's food. actually very good. That's actually very, very good because we have something prepared for you here. Really? And I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. The lineup is crazy. The lineup is crazy. <laughs> the lineup is Doesn't crazy. Doesn't represent the people in here. It yes. Does. Cuts across all ten states of the country. Yeah. Whoa. And how many how many tribes do you guys have in here? Over sixty four. Over sixty four tribes. Yes. And all the tribes have a different food that they eat. Uh, yes. That would be interesting. <laughs> Doesn't mean I'm gonna eat sixty four different kind of food. No. We wish. <laughs> we need to tell me, tell, me, that tell me something that I need to know about South Sudanese food. So we like uh, asida. What mm -hmm. we call asida in other mm -hmm. countries it's ugali. Okay. Um, or posho. Or posho. Yeah. Uh, so that is a very common food that we eat. Okay. Uh, we also like uh, what we call mola. So it's different. We have reds, we have greens. So we like vegetables, we like meat. Yeah, fish. We create everything. Yeah. All together. All together. All together. But it's not like we mix them. <laughs> it's not like you mix No, it's not like we mix them. But, we <laughs> but it's different dishes. We yeah. create everything. Yes. Tell me something about yourself. Ooh, my name is Nyadak Maya. Um, I love content creating. I love taking pictures and traveling around the world. Mm. And my goal is to travel around South Sudan. Okay, so yeah. what I found out is that when I came to this country, I realized that there are not content creators. So All right. I mean, we're creating our first video today, mm -hmm. and we're gonna get another video on your channel yes. so that people that want to see more of South Sudan will see South Sudan from you girls. Exactly. And I'm Paula, and also um, an upcoming content creator, and it's very amazing to meet you, Wademaya. Thank you. And so we're just here trying to, you know, to you know, do what Wodemaya does for <laughs> Africa, you know? I'm like, what are we doing for South Sudan? You know, and things it's like that. It's time to show South Sudan exactly. to the world. Exactly. So, but, but I mean, right now I'm so hungry. Where are we going to get the food? So <laughs> we're actually... Over to the shooting area, which okay. is actually yeah. by the Nile. Okay. Yeah. Very beautiful scenery. By the Nile. Exactly. Food. Yo, we yeah. eat beside the Nile. Yes. Amazing. Yeah. I hope I'm going to get some fish from the Nile. <laughs> <laughs> Straight from the Nile. All right, come yeah. on, let's go. Yeah, so finally we're the mile. We're here. So make yourself comfortable. Make myself comfortable. As we wait to enjoy South Sudan. Is is no one is gonna see me eat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Amazing. And we're going to use our hands the by the way. See, I love eating with my hands. <laughs> Yeah, this shows yeah. that I'm a real actor. We're gonna use our hands. Thank you so Actually, much. Actually, we really <laughs> use uh, Fox. Fox, yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. That's very strange. Do you know that I, I've actually found my new favorite country in Africa? <laughs> South You're Sudan. Many times. Hello. Oh. Hi. How are you doing? I'm good. Nice Thank to meet you, you man. Yeah. Where's the food? The food is here. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> All right, yeah. so you go ahead and then. Awesome. So some of the things we'd like you to try, of course we have the fish, which okay. is almost like something we eat every day. All right. But we have different varieties here as well. Um, this one is called Kudra, which you're going to try today. Oh, okay. So yeah. It's just greens with some meat uh, made with uh, what we call a mufraka in Arabic. Yeah. So it's, it's this 
Yeah. It's probably the yeah. You know, yeah, the what is it called? I don't think it has an English name. You call it mofraka. But yeah, it's just like um, yeah. just like a cooking stick, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. But now for vegetables, yes. like, yeah. Yeah. And, so and then we have a cedar. Mm -hmm. So this is like posho, like maize flour mm. that has been, yeah. So like a cedar is like um, ugali. Ugali. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Pop in South yeah. Africa. Yeah. But sometimes we also mix them with a uh, cassava here, mm. bread with cassava. Yeah. So you okay. also have brown flour, white flour, Fla yeah, all the way. Uh, we also have um, kombo, which is actually one of South Sudan's most popular dishes. Yes. Okay. Uh, everybody has had kombo. Yeah. Uh, and I think when everybody comes, they need to try kombo. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. So it's greens as well with the peanut butter. Hmm. And yeah. I'm gonna have a And then good we time have here. also, um, I think, bamia, okra. Mm -hmm. I'm yes. gonna have all this on the table today. <laughs> yes. Fantastic. Please. Your wish. <laughs> we're ordering everything, okay? <laughs> Thank you. Poor guy is so afraid. Oh, oh the food is here. The food is here. Oh, this Finally. Is like, oh my god. Okay. Yeah. So we have combo here, we have kudra, and then bamya. And then this one is called Asida. It's ugali? Yes. So this is the, the brown brownish one. ugali. <laughs> I mean, yo, it's good to travel, man. I mean, I thought ugali is always white. Yeah, this is the brown one. And actually, they say this one kind of holds your stomach better than, than the, the white one. The white oh, one. so this is the white ugali? Yes. And this is the brown ugali? Exactly. But does this have different names? All aceda aceda? They're all aceda. Yeah, yes. So brown aceda and white aceda. Exactly. <laughs> Then we also have the kitra, mm. which is also a popular uh, that you can eat with the sauces. Okay. Um, this one also can be white or brown. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then actually, when it is dried, it can be made juice. This one? Yeah. yeah. When it's dry, you yeah, can... like the leftovers. What, what what is the national juice in this country? I mean, that juice that whenever you come to this country, you need to try it out. Kere kere. Kere kere. Kere kere. Do you have kere kere here? We'll check. Please ask them yeah. if they have Yeah, kare. we can check with them and see if yeah. they have so kare we kare. can come in here. You can have some kare kare. Yeah. Can we just wash our hands? Let's and wash our hands and eat. eat. Okay, so usually in our culture, people eat together. Okay. Yes. So like we you have a sense of community. Exactly. exactly. It's a communal society, so you would never find each person with a plate. plate yeah. Like, yeah. That's something new. <laughs> so you put the food together as it is here, okay. and then you will pick what you want to eat. Uh -huh, and then you dip and we then eat together. Dip, yeah. And then you eat. That's it. Can you show me how you're going to eat so that I'll be able to follow? Yes. So I will start with the khudra. So you can just take some of the kisra and then dip it. Because it can sometimes... It's slimy. Yeah, uh -huh. it is. <laughs> slimy, okay. So good. So good. So she tried it. But, but, but uh, what is a green made of? <laughs> no, I mean like, I'm just gonna... Yeah. Okay. It's like a lot of greens, man. <laughs> it's very slimy. Good and healthy. Mm. It actually tastes like a, a dish in Ghana. Mm -hmm. This one. Do they make it the same way? No, really. Okay. Or what kind of leaves do they use? Uh, I don't even know how to call it in English, <laughs> but it's called arewio or something. But it's also slimy. It's slimy. Oh. Yeah. yeah. I definitely think you should try this one. What am I trying this one with? This combo. You, you can, can try, try it with whatever it is you like. With whatever you like. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Okay, this one tastes like fufu. <laughs> I mean, I have to swallow. Yes. Of or course. chew. Oh, chew. chew or I would recommend you chew. Chew, yeah. <laughs> I don't think this is chew. Swallow. <laughs> ah, this is swallow. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> this is swallow. See, one, two, three, and just. Hmm. Yeah. I taste. think this will be my favorite. The really? taste of happiness. You got peanuts mm -hmm. in there. Mm -hmm. You still got this in the here. The greens, yep. The greens yeah. in here. Uh huh. Wow. This is one. Meat. There's meat. There's meat in there. See the way I'm going back again. <laughs> it seems. I mean, this one will be my favorite. Yeah. I mean, so with this one, we mm. also have a fish version. 
Okay. Yeah, so you can also substitute the meat for fish. So with the meat, it's called kombu laham. With the fish, it's kombu samak. Kombu samak? Yes. Samak? Samak, yeah, exactly. Swahili? Ah. Actually, Arabic and Swahili oh, yeah, are very close. Okay. Are you guys not eating? Like you're that we meat. are. I love it. I love it. Okay. I love it. I mean, I've tried this one. So far, I prefer this mm -hmm. over that one. I mean, you still haven't tried this one. Can I try that one? Yes. What do you want to try it with? Is okra? Yes, okra. By the way, we like chili. So, if you like chili, if you like chili. I, I love chili. I mean, okay. From West Africa, I, I have to try this with what? Any. Maybe we can try it with this, this one. one. This is the ugali, yeah? This is the ugali. We call it a seda. You guys don't put salt in ugali? No. Do you put salt here? No. no. <laughs> but I, I feel like all your food are swallow, swallow, swallow. <laughs> but we have to only chew them. Hmm. This is good. Mm. I knew you'd like it. Wow. <laughs> Bamiya is nice. Wow. This is called what? Bamiya. It's dried okra. Dried okra. Mm. Dried? Dried okra, yeah. I mean, I, I eat the fresh one in Ghana. Mm -hmm. I never knew like you guys eat yeah. the dry one. We I mean, eat both the fresh one and the, and dry, the dry one. one. Yeah. So we also have the one where it is the whole okra. Mm -hmm. It's called Bamiya Tabiq. So it's stew is usually red in color. So with tomatoes and this one, this one doesn't have any tomatoes. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, or any extras. So but it's just okra and then? It's just okra and then the mufraka that we talked about earlier, okay. which is um, the, like a it's like a stick that is used. That is used. Like it, yeah. mm -hmm. So right. it's the same one that's used to make these two dishes. Okay. So the women would just mufraka away. <laughs> 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 we would say it in our videos when we start making them. Yeah, we'll yeah show because we'll show you how us, it's how it's made. Show, you need to show us how. We'll all show this you food how it's made. made. Yes. I mean, like maybe I need to even try my best to learn how all this food are made. Yes. In here, but I think I will still go for this one. This <laughs> your You have one last one. Huh? You try it. Again? Yes. <laughs> We love to eat, and you. Oh, okay. And by the way, when you go to eat at somebody's house, you mm -hmm. have to finish your food. Yeah. So am I gonna finish this? You need to. No, I, we'll see. We'll see if we want to be nice to you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what occasions do people eat this? I'm oh, this is like every day. Every day. Every day. Every day. Is it breakfast? No. It's lunch and dinner. Lunch, lunch and, and dinner. dinner. Yes. Oh, okay. Wow. Every day, if you go to South Rennes restaurant, you can find South Rennes everywhere eating this. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. So you guys don't eat rice? Rarely. Rarely. Wow. I don't even think people actually eat rice. Maybe if, yeah, I, I don't think so. Mm. Actually, a lot of people find that rice is not very filling. Yeah. And also because you end up with communities that, are, you know, people are hard workers, they're farmers, mm. they're... Amazing. So they would like food that yeah, would fulfill rice them. Is not food. Yeah. Rice is not food. Mm -hmm. I want a cedar. <laughs> <laughs> It's just like when you go to Ghana, mm. people will tell you that, yo, give me real food, you know. Exactly. I mean, my mom used to say that I can never eat rice and sleep at night. <laughs> it feels like I've not eaten. I've not eaten. Exactly. exactly. That's the we same feel thing the exam exact. We feel the same exact way. So, what, so maybe you can try this with kisra. This is tegelia and this is dried okra. As well. Okra Again. as well, yes. yes. But Why? made different. In, it, with now red sauce. Why is it that all your dishes are okra, 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 or something slimy? We like okra. Yeah? We like okra and slimy things. They sit well in your stomach. Slimy. Hey, okay. Does this have beans? Nope. Just dried okra. Just dried okra. I think for the staple food, I prefer. This mm -hmm. over this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the combination that I think is the best in here is this <laughs> and this one. I mean, I, I, I'm not from South Sudan. I've tasted all the um, different dishes that they got in here. Mm -hmm. But I would say that if I should give mask, this one will have 110 over 100. Wow. <laughs> wow. I'm glad no. you actually found something you like. No, because I love fufu. You know fufu? Mm -hmm. yeah. Fufu in Ghana is my favorite. And this one, it feels like you're eating 
I mean kokonte. We have a dish in Ghana called kokonte, okay. which is also brownish, but it's like um, a dried cassava that is pounded together mm. and then use hot water to, make, I mean, yeah. make it. Right. And exactly with the peanuts, we have a soup in Ghana called peanut soup. And this one, it feels like you're eating exactly the same food. It now. feels like home. <laughs> See your home. <laughs> Everywhere in Africa is really home. It's home. Wow. It's home. Let me try this. Try it. Try it. Try it out. I mean, it's your own country, so you can't try it out. <laughs> <laughs> Just tell me you want to eat this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we're here yeah. under the tree. This looks like a neem tree. <laughs> Yeah, it's a, it is a neem tree. It's I very common here. How we are not going to drink a neem <laughs> tea? Because it's so bitter. But you see, it's also medicinal, but that's for another day. Okay. So we are here today uh, going to try the South Sudanese most famous drink, actually. We and have, we, we have yes, to drink it here? We have to drink it here. So it's the culture. Just sit under the tree, have your tea served, and enjoy yourself. Thank you. What kind yeah. of tea is that? So we are going to have karakede. Karakede? So it's hibiscus. Oh, hibiscus leaf? Yes. Hot Flowers, hot. actually, yeah. Hot. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Can yeah. I have tea? She doesn't yes, does understand? No. Yeah, no. Say, say, <laughs> let, me, let me say that. Uh, in Arabic. In Arabic. She say, I'm going to share. I'm going to share. I'm going to share. I'm going to share. I need tea, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, so. So, yeah, so, in a day, what did you Salata. So, we are going to have three. Different? The same hibiscus, the, the, the hibiscus uh -huh. tea, yeah. And, it, and she'll try it for us. Okay. So, you're going to try what, you know, South Sudanese enjoy here in South Sudan. All right. Yeah. So go ahead and give us Yeah, tea. so prepare for us the tea. Literally, it's the same one you're talking about. Anadera, Anadera, Ashram, Shai. Anadera, Ashram, Shai. I'm Shai. Yeah. Shai. You know how Kenyans say Chai? Okay. You say Shai. So you were saying, you're about to say something. You said, oh, this is the one you're talking about. It's yeah, like tea, it's, it's the not one. a drink. So we do it both. <laughs> yeah. You can make juice from it and then have it and then at the same time. So here we are. So we are just waiting for you. You know, to... it feels so good. Like I can see the road right at the front of me. Exactly. And I'm here just enjoying myself, man. It's really yeah. crazy. Yeah. Wow. So that's what people mostly do here in South Sudan. If you just want to chill, people come under the trees because there's good shade. Yeah. So we just take tea. Not specifically this. There's coffee as well. Okay. There's the green tea. Any form and of it, exactly. It's not done yet. Yeah, we can go ahead and <laughs> taste the food to how you like it. If it's light, yeah, it, it, it's so red. Like, oh my goodness. <laughs> so before we have to say fadan. What? Fadan. Fadan. Yeah. So like. What does that mean? You know, welcome. Welcome. Fadan. We have to welcome you to, to our tea. Okay. So fadan. Thank you. Shukra. Yeah, shukran. <laughs> you got it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, is there... I'm 
camera ready yet, but I, I still have to try it out. <laughs> it's hard. It is hard. Really, it is. really hard. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> it is hard, yeah, it is hard. Wow, he's still trying. No, I, it's not like I'm still trying. It's hard. It's hard. <laughs> I don't want to hurt myself. There's so many food to eat in there in South Sudan. It is hard. I'm also going, going to really struggle. Ah! You said this is what? A main yeah. national drink? Yeah. Oh my goodness. It's famous here. Yeah. So Let me tell you something. Like, I feel like Africa is just one place. Exactly, it you is. You know how we call this in Ghana? No, okay. Maybe I might be mistaken. Let me drink proper. <laughs> this is called Sobolo. You know that? Really? It's just that I've not taken it hot before. It's always in the fridge. Oh. So you drink the cold version. Mm -hmm. But this is like, in where I'm from, we call it Bisap. When you go to Accra and the rest, they call it Sobolo. Ah, Sobolo. So it's just the same thing, hibiscus flowers. <laughs> so we have it as tea and at the same time as just a normal drink like juice, put it in the fridge mm. and then have it. Africa is just one place, man. It is one. You just have to travel and go find out. Because if I never come in here, I thought Sobolo is just a Ghana national drink. Not knowing when you go to South Sudan, it's their national drink, but they drink it hot. Wow. Is it the same thing for is it the same one in this one? Is it a tea bag? Yeah, it's the tea bag. It's the one. So we make... <laughs> and they put a mint. Yep. Jeez, I yeah. was like, what is she doing? <laughs> Will I be able to drink this? Whoa. I mean, it's my first time drinking like this. Oh, how do you find it? Um, it tastes good, but kind of weird. Yo, you know what? There are also YouTubers in here. I mean, the channel is pretty new, but you know how we always do it. I want them to tell stories from South Sudan. So do me a favor, go to their YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe, it's by force. I'm not even gonna beg you. <laughs> it's by force for you to subscribe to their YouTube channel. Help them grow, help them tell stories from this beautiful country. And hey, it's your favorite village boy, Mr. Ghana, baby, right here. In South Sudan, Juba, any final message to them? Oh yeah, and the YouTube channel it will be called South and Drop. So dropping content straight from South Sudan. Amazing, man. How do you say bye-bye? Masalam. Masalam, asalam alaikum. <laughs> <laughs>